Welcome back to my channel and to my first festive vlog of the season. I'm so excited. I really felt this year, like deep in my heart, that I wanted to do festive vlogs on my channel throughout the month of December. And that's because I never really normally vlog unless I'm traveling or when I was doing the flat, but they're actually my favorite videos to watch back. And they're the only videos I actually ever watch back of mine. They just make such lovely memories and I have so much going on this month. Like I really wanted to make the most out of the festive season, mainly to make up for last year, but also just because life is short and I just want to do as much and see as many friends as possible um, and I thought that I could capture that and bring it to you guys in a sparkly magical weekly video. <laughs> so today is the first one although I may be uploading a video before this when I decorate my flat because I haven't actually done my Christmas tree or anything like that yet. I'm doing that later on this week and I'm going to film the whole process of like decorating the tree and um, the rest of the flat for Christmas so I think that should be up before this video so if you haven't seen it then definitely go and watch it. But today I'm actually headed off to a little festive overnight stay with Victor and Rolf, who you guys know is my absolute favourite brand um, for perfume. And we're headed off today to Wilderness, which is really exciting. We haven't got great weather, but I'm hoping it's going to be more like a cosy vibe rather than like an outdoorsy vibe, you know? So I'm just finishing getting all of my stuff together, getting ready, and then we'll be off. My bags are all packed. I'm very excited. I always get so many questions um, on this luggage. So it's from Bricks. It's very beautiful, that very old school sort of Italian vibe. And I just left my shoes out because I was just trying on my outfit to make sure that it looked fabulous before I packed it. So these are the heels I'm going to wear to the party and dinner tonight. They're from Coast, as you can see. And they're kind of dupes for those, um, is it Mac and Mac? Is that how you pronounce it? Those really trendy, incredible embellished heels that are like everywhere right now on Instagram and celebrities and that kind of thing. They're so pretty, but they're so expensive. And I feel like these are such a good dupe. They're so pretty as well when they're on because the strap kind of like wraps around you a bit. I really, really love them. And then this is my fabulous dress for this evening. Um, it could do with a little steam actually, but I'll wait till I get there. If you guys watched my um, party wear video from a couple of weeks ago, then you will have seen this beautiful dress from Coast, which I actually honestly think looks like it could be by Victor and Rolf. Um, it's so the style with like the tulle and the tears. It's so over the top and so much fun. Um, so I really, really can't wait to wear this tonight with the shoes, of course. Although guys, look at my nails. They are absolutely horrific. I have had no time to get myself to a salon, especially in December when the schedule is so, so packed full. I just don't know when I'm going to have time. So I don't know if you guys have noticed in my stories and my video last week, but I have been wearing the Kiss Impress press on manicure. If anyone was watching me um, during lockdown, then they will know I was so obsessed with these because obviously we couldn't get to the salon at all because they were closed. And I honestly can't stand painting my own nails. I do not have the patience. I don't seem to be very good at it. I just always smudge it and it never looks good. And these are the perfect solution. I love these because the pale pink is perfect. It's literally my go-to nail color. And then I really love this adorable, this little glittery accent nail. It's so nice for the festive season um, and it will be so lovely for the party tonight. I really love the freedom they give you because if I was gonna get like gel nails, I probably wouldn't do an accent nail because I wouldn't want to keep it for three weeks. But for these, you can have a little bit more freedom because if you get bored of it, you can just remove it and replace it with a pink one or just change the style all together, but they do last for seven days. They're also so easy to apply. Um, so I'm going to show you now how to apply them. Okay guys, I've just set my camera up on my table so you can see exactly what I'm doing. So here are the nails. Um, there are 30 nails in there, like mixed sizes. So the first thing you need to do is get them out um, and pick the sizes for your fingernails. And I've also cut my fingernails like down a little bit. Um, to make sure they sit on nicely. So first of all, I'm just cleaning my nails with a little wipe um, in the prep kit. This is just to get rid of any dirt, any residue that will stop the nails from lasting. And then it also comes with a little cuticle stick. So you can push your cuticles back um, to really let the nails sit into the nail bed. And then literally all you do is get the nail and peel off the little sticky plastic 
at the back. Pop the nail on and then give it a really nice like hard press to make sure it's really really stuck to your nail. It's literally as simple as that so I'm going to go in with the accent nail now, the lovely sparkly accent nail. Give it a good old press. <laughs> okay now let's quickly finish the rest of my hand. And then once the nails are all on you can use the little file that comes in the kit to just give them a little shape if you want to shorten them down a little bit or round off the edges if you prefer um, a round look to a square look. You can basically just customise them so they're exactly how you like. So guys, here is the finished look of the nails. I just love them so much. I think they're so pretty and they're just so quick and easy to put on. And I just think they look really real as well. Like I've just had a lovely manicure, but in fact, they only were 8 99 and took me about five minutes to do. So I'm all ready to go now. I've got my lovely Santini coat on and I just can't wait to get to wilderness. look at this room where we're having lunch it is absolutely magnificent look at the Victor and Rolf tree oh my goodness and this is scarily similar to what I am wearing this evening for dinner <laughs> wow I think the whole tree would come down uh, if I need to do it. <laughs> yeah, you think you're being funny, just wreck it. Rock it. You look great. Yeah, Oh, yeah, 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 no, it needs to be Yeah. I know. It's stupid rain. Oh, that's beautiful. Right at me like that. Yeah. Amazing. Is it warm in there? Hey, do you want to do a spinny one? Yeah. Is it warm? Is it warm in there? Um, yeah. So I'm going to catch it. You need to take it to the floor. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, it ties up all the way down. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't really. I love it. Oh my gosh. I look at it. Look at that. It's amazing, right? You'll be like, oh, you yeah. it. it's amazing. Oh my god, that is absolutely I mean, amazing, that picture. Tasteful, <laughs> really tasteful. <laughs> <laughs> Please get a picture right now. I feel like the ugly sisters. <laughs> 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 Good thing we're all friends here, isn't it? Yeah, I know. Good thing we're all comfortable with each other. There you go. <laughs> Hey guys, it's been a couple of days since you last saw me. Um, we got back from Wilderness yesterday. 
and I was so tired. I got really, really sniffly and sneezy. As you can kind of hear, I'm still a little bit congested, but for some reason, my immune system seems to be really working at the moment, and every time I almost get ill, my body just seems to fight it off, so I'm really, really grateful for that. Um, but it's another day and another lovely event. So tonight's event is with Farfetch, which is exciting because I've been working with Farfetch forever and they've never done like a big in-person event. So I'm really looking forward to it. Josie's going as well. And I think she's gonna come back and stay the night here tonight, which I'm really looking forward to. She'll probably actually be my first sleeping guest that isn't JJ. <laughs> my dress for tonight um, just arrived from Farfetch, literally in the nick of time. Um, they gifted us a dress um, of our choice to wear for um, the day and the evening. And I got mine in two sizes because I wasn't sure um, which size would be best. So I'm gonna try them on now. Um, they might need a little steam, but as you can see, it's pink. It's pink, but it's still, I think, quite festive. <laughs> Oh my gosh guys, here is the dress on and I love it so, so much. I'm actually so relieved because this looked really good on the model on the website but I was worried that it was going to be one of those dresses that you get at home and you put it on yourself and you're just like, oh my god, it's a disaster. But it's incredible. I'll link it down below for you guys. I did actually get it on sale, um, which is cool and I'm just obsessed with it. Like the pleats, the big bow, it's just so dramatic and I feel like it is quite festive. I kind of look like a quality street which I'm loving, or a little Christmas fairy. Oh my God, I love this dress so much. I'm so, so happy. I feel like I should wear it with like my knee high white boots to kind of make it a bit more like rock and roll, if that makes sense, because it's super over the top and girly. Um, but yeah, I am so pleased with the dress and thank goodness it got here on time. <laughs> then just a quick little spritz of my favorite perfume at the moment, which is the favorite from Penhaligons. I just think this bottle is so festive. Even though it's not festive fragrance, I think with the red and gold label and the pink velvet bow, it's so cute. Every 20 minutes? Well, that one was 15 minutes, so now they'll be every 20 minutes. 
Oh la la, I have a very lovely little visitor. Freddy's first non JJ sleepover. Yes! Yes, I can feel villaged. Merci madame. Oh, do you like so it? Beautiful. Yay. Coming from someone who has spent the last two years of my life doing renovations, Freddie has done such Aww. a good job here. Every detail, like the light switches, the paint, every detail, you have just done it to such a high quality. Thank I'm you. So oh, Cal. He always looks sad. He That's just sticky. naturally like looks eyes. cow. Underneath his fluff. No, there's his nose. There's his nostrils. Ah, let me let you see, Mr. Cow. <laughs> Good day. Now he looks a bit evil, doesn't he? <laughs> it's a bit scary like now. <laughs> oh, he's coming, fat. Marie. Marie. Cow and Marie. Come on, Eileen. Time has come to say goodnight. To say goodnight to the morning light. The time has come. We've had so much fun today. Tomorrow's just a dream away. Oh, oh damn. Is that good night then? Good night. Good night. Good morning, everyone. Josie was up earlier than me, of course, and she did a little prep order. And I've got a lovely almond croissant to wake up to with a lovely glass of fresh orange juice. Delicious. So today I'm actually going to get my first Christmas tree for the flat so I'm very very excited although you guys will have already seen this because I'm going to be filming a whole video on decorating the flat for Christmas which will be up before this video so if you haven't seen that already then of course go back and watch it um, but I'm really excited my first Christmas in the flat and I really want to go all out so my dad um, is going to take me to get a Christmas tree I want a really really big one um, and then I need to also just buy some decorations as well because I have nowhere near enough and we're going we're going pink obviously <laughs> And I think I'm actually going to wear the Aperis coat that Farfetch have loaned me. I don't know when they're coming back to pick it up. But I'm going to make the most out of it because I just love it. And it's really nice to be able to give it a test run to see if I do want to actually buy it. So this is the OOTD. Little Josie's beautiful suitcase in the background that I'm very, very jealous of. This coat is magical. I love it so much. So I'm wearing my Abercrombie brown jumper dress which is my favourite, it's so comfy and so cosy. My new Burberry scarf, which I'm very, very glad I kept. I just think it looks stunning and the pink and brown goes so well together. My D&G quilted Sicily bag. My Stuart Weitzman over the knee boots, of course. I love this look. This is the perfect shopping for your first ever Christmas tree outfit, if you ask me. <laughs> also, can we just appreciate that my nails are on day four? I think, the press-on nails, um, and they are still perfect. They haven't even lifted off a tiny bit. Um, and I've washed my hair, so that's super impressive. Shall we see your outfit of the day? Yes, let's start with my beautiful socks. The most glamorous part of the outfit of the day. These LK Bennett cashmere socks that I've been wearing for three days in a row now. <laughs> because I've had two sleepovers in a row. So this is Freddie's jumper. That looks nice. Thank you. Over the top of my jumper dress that I've also been wearing for three days in a row. <laughs> It's a family reunion, everybody's here Gathered round the table full of holiday cheer Put on a record nice and low Sit by the window, we can watch the snow Oh my, oh my It's mighty cold outside So call up your friends together as long as we're able so guys the tree is up it looks so majestic it's superior it's the best tree i've ever seen i'm so happy i can't decorate it today because it's still quite wet 
um, so I don't want to put the lights on and get electrocuted and ruin all my decorations. So I'll be decorating it in a couple of days, which will be in a different vlog, but you'll have hopefully already seen. Um, and for now, I think I'm just going to chill out, tidy up, because this evening, me and my whole family are going to see Andrew Lloyd Webber's Cinderella in Covent Garden, which I'm so excited about. It was my mum's birthday a few days ago, and that was her birthday present from us. So we're all going there tonight. It's such an amazing show and we have incredible seats as well, so I'm very, very excited. Morning, guys look at this lovely festive background with the mistletoe it has been such a busy few days I'm feeling pretty exhausted I've kind of gone from like being literally a recluse in my flat during the month of November because I had so much work to do to just event after event after event and I'm like oh my god I'm so tired but it's been so lovely and I really hope you've enjoyed seeing it there's so much more to come although I think today will be the last day of this vlog and honestly guys it's just going to be a chilled one today there's so much I need to do I really need to clean the flat um, or at least tidy it because it's been a little bit neglected um, I also need to edit this vlog and I also need to do some online Christmas shopping because I'm pretty unorganized today is like two weeks I think till Christmas or two weeks till Christmas Eve so I don't have long at all and I'm really not feeling organized I think the Sun just came out Wow, that feels very unusual and <laughs> um, the weather has been so bad um, so yes, that's what I'm going to get up to today. I might put a Christmas movie on or a Christmas playlist. I'm thinking maybe The Nutcracker because I'm actually going to see The Nutcracker very soon. I think you'll see it in the next vlog. Um, so I need to get myself into the spirit. So maybe a little bit of Tchaikovsky is exactly what I need. Um, so yeah, let's get on with a nice cozy day. I'm actually wearing this really beautiful um, knitwear set from Ellie Darby's brand, which is called Angel Collection. I love it so much. I'm also wearing these beautiful earrings from Marais, um, which I featured in my gift guide. I'll just um, give you a close up actually. Look how pretty they are. They're little huggy hoops with moonstone. So I'm very much looking forward to a nice cozy festive day at home. And I really hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog. Make sure you come back for the next one. Um, but for now, let's get a Christmas movie on. <laughs> 